Hello, I'm Nolt, and today it, I'm going to be doing a channel update, and I've put some um, gameplay of my FS16 main save in the background, just so that there's something to see. And this is actually live gameplay, but it's not about this for now, because, well, I want to talk about a bit about my opinion on copper and what I, or as it, or the official name, child, child online privacy protection something. Uh, oh, well, I currently don't, well, I actually forgot what, uh, it was child online privacy protection act, act by the FTC, oh, and I think, F if I remember correctly, FTC is the Federal Trade Commission, and that's from, and they're from the US, and well, where is it, they had a case against YouTube, because YouTube apparently went against copper, which states that advertising on content which has to do with advertising content for children and all that. And, well, I've decided, and, well, now uh, all YouTubers have to put their channel, have to say what is what they are, tar what they are targeting for content or main viewers. And in my case, I'm uh, mainly target, I'm not, but, well, and we only and you have two options, which is either not specifically kids or kids. At least here in Germany, it's if you directly translate it like that. And the reason why, I well, and I've put it on to not specifically for kids because well, I've I main my I'm mainly targeting my videos to those people who are interested, and that's not just kids. I mean, I do have, I mean, well, yeah. I mean, I do have, do a bit, quite a lot of content which might appeal to kids, but well, I'm not really trying to appeal to kids because, well, my main audience, for example, in the case of my Out and About series is well, which I'm actually kind of pausing, to be honest, because I don't really know how to do it at the moment, because, well, I haven't gone out to be really that much, and, well, I think that I should be first get some better camera equipment, but still, if I... Let's just talk my All and About series as an example. I mainly do those videos for people who like to see mach farming machinery working in the fields and stuff like that or my sequel farmer videos where ki which are supposed which are mainly reviews which I do because well some I have seen that there aren't too many videos of certain si Siku stuff, or oh, yeah, that there aren't too many videos about certain Siku, Siku models, and I decided to check to add my opinion to it and to give some more variety. If, even though there wasn't really too much, to be honest, at the start, and I and I mean, yeah, kids do like those small tractors, but I, but there are also modelers which could use them, for example, the, there's a trail, the 2 Excel trailer which Siku sells, which currently is in, which currently has a, blur, black, a black frame and red body, which I honestly think is actually useless, the trailer I mean, but the choice is good. But 
models could use that tra the ba the trailer chassis to act to build some nice trailers, and that was the first thing regarding copper. And the second thing is well is well about the game you see in the background of a sixteen, and I'm. Um, Thinking about doing a series on here as well. And if you're wondering what's currently going on with the FS18 series, I've just kind of lost interest at the moment in recording, but I might resume it soon. And well, what I'm the reason why I haven't started doing a let's play of FS16 as well. There is one decision which impacts the start by quite a lot, which I haven't been able to make. Because, well, if you, here it's actually a bit different to FS18, because on FS18, when once you choose a difficulty, I don't think there's a real, really a way to take that difficulty away. And, well, but here in FS16, it already, when you're starting a new save, oops, wrong character, when you're starting a new save, it's always so that you won't, that you'll get asked first if you want, what mode you want to be in, or what difficulty. And there are three ones, beginner, would beginner, Normal and expert, and I'm thinking about and I'm thinking about using expert or beginner because well, beginner you started with, with a lot of grain in the silos, and that could help with a kickstart on the series so that I won't have to do as much with the small equipment, and get a, and can get on to the bigger stuff so you can see that as well. Well, if I were to go to expert, I would ha I would need to work my way fully up to the big machinery, which my which is more realistic, but it will take a long time. So yeah, and if and I'm and this is also live gameplay to be actually because well, I'm just. I've I just didn't bother to do the vi to do video I oh know I just didn't bother to really do the to really take the time to first do a background the gameplay here in the background and then do another recording with the gameplay and the sound in the background so that I will because, well, in a way that's kind of stupid, but, yeah. So basically, and please write your, please write in the comments down below if you want me to use expert mode or beginner's mode when I'm going to start for the FS16 FS Let's Play. Because, well, I would really like to see what you rather want a quick start a kick start or quicker start off where where it will take longer or a long or expert mode where I'll have to get all the money myself in or work for everything not and I mean with everything really everything because with beginner's boat, you get great, quite a lot of grain in the silos already, which does give you a bit of, which if you sell, it does give you a bit of a money advantage, and so you won't have to work as much. So yeah, ever do it hard. So the two options are do it, do the six, FS sixteen. Let's play hardcore, so expert mode or a quick start 
right, which basically means the beginner's mode, or if you want, or even normal mode if you want to. So yeah, and also if you're wondering if I'm going to do a let's play of FS twenty, I will. I will hopefully do that, but well, the problem is my phone isn't compatible. And in case you're wondering what phone I use, it's a Samsung, Gal Samsung Galaxy S3 Neo, and it's pretty old as well. I've had it for quite a few years though, but I mean, why get something new if it, if it still holds its worth? or? Makes it keep or uh, makes it worth keeping. So and I, but I can honestly understand why my phone can't handle it because I've watched a first look video from the YouTuber Dagoran and holy smokes, I is the only thing I really can say because FS twenty it more looks like. It's real. It's really a new generation of mobile games for the F for farming simulator series because well, if you because well here FS sixteen and FS eighteen, they are basically play. They're basically just flat planes where the machines run on with no hills or anything like that. While FS twenty is, or at least it looks. Like, it's just a ver mobile version of FS19, because, well, you have multiple types of crops there, just, and the graphics are just, just, wow. And I can put, well, and I'll put the link to the first look I've mentioned, first look video I've mentioned down in the descrip description below, just so you can find it and yeah but and just to sum the video up my for about copper I'm going to be doing um I've put my channel on to not specially for kids because I don't target kids directly only indirectly then FS 16 let's play two options for the starting mode it's all free, difficult, or well, I mean, beginners, which basically is a, which basically gives me a kickstart. Then normal, which still gives me kind of a starting base in the meaning of crops and sinal, but won't really do have as much. So I won't get as much money, or export mode, which means that I'll have to get all the money myself in. Then FS and then FS twenty. I won't be able to do a let's play on it until I get a new phone. So that's basically the sit and the FS eighteen let's play. I will. Ooh, I might be posting some new videos of that soon, but I. But it is not ending. But it hasn't ended. I just kind of put a pause onto it. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Well, now thanks for watching. And I'll see you soon.